love. All right, Scorpio. Starting off with your overall energy, we'll take a look at your person's overall energy. Then we're going to see what they're up to and what's going on. All right. Oh, Scorpio. Are you feeling abandoned, orphaned, left out in the cold, left hanging in the dark? Oh, I don't like when that energy pops up for you guys, Scorpio. I hope you're not isolating. You're isolating. Breathe. Um, you could be uh, reflecting, going within, meditating. Spirit could just be saying, breathe. It's okay. I got you. You know. Um, but let's see what Scorpio's person's overall energy, Scorpio, truth be told, did some kind of a truth come out? Do they want to tell you some kind of a truth? Well, they want to heal this, uh, Scorpio, and your cards are flying all over today. I feel like this person sees your value and your worth here, Scorpio, um, but they do want to mend this. So... That's why I'm saying I feel like spirit's kind of like, I got you, Scorpio. It's okay. Uh, if you want to, if you want to, some of you may be like, okay, yeah, buzz off, tarot reader lady. I don't want nothing to do with this person. That's fine. Totally fine. Um, I'm not here to tell you what to do. But I do feel like this person wants to heal this and mend this. They may want to come towards you and tell you some kind of a truth. Take that false mask off and... and open up. Uh, but let's see, we're going to get into your person's uh, current situation, current energy, see what's going on. Scorpio, keep in mind when I say your person's energies, it could be flip-flopped and reversed, so feel free to switch it. Some messages may be for you, some may not. If it resonates, leave the rest. All right, your person's starting off with three of the cups, three of cups and the moon, and ace of swords in reverse secrets, hiding something. I feel like this person was hiding something. They weren't being truthful. They weren't being honest. Three of Cups can be drinking, celebrating, going out with friends. It could be a third party, a person, place, or thing uh, that you feel left in the dark about. And I feel like that's what the theme of this reading is here. Ace of Swords in reverse. Okay, Queen of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sag could be dealing with a fire sign or it could have been a fire sign that got in the way of this. Uh, this person could have been going around, the King and Queen of uh, Wands is my single pair, attractive, fun, flirty, outgoing, plays that single energy. There's definitely some conflict, fighting, self-sabotage going on here. And the wheel to ten of pentacles all right I feel like this person Scorpio wants to move on from whatever this is this situation that you were left in the dark I feel like they want to move on if you were married or living with this person it's like they want to put that family dynamic back together um I feel like this person wants to like do life with you or, or go all the way. Long-term stability, family, house, home, loyalty. But there's there's something that was hidden. Let's see if we can find out, shall we? Um, what was blocking this connection, commitment? Were they already in a commitment? Was this person already married to somebody? Maybe they lied to you about it, hid it from you, or gave you, like, that false hope. I'm not happy. I'm going to leave. I swear. That kind of a thing. But commitment of some sort was being blocked here. Knight of Cups, Pisces energy in reverse. I feel like this person, they either haven't apologized yet, or they couldn't be, like, fully romantic. Um genuinely romantic couldn't come towards you like love offers things like that we have three of swords in reverse as a blockage four of cups rejection ignoring boredom i kind of feel like i know where this is going here scorpio 
I feel like this person was in a commitment. Could have been you, could have been them, could have been you guys together, but I feel like it was actually this person was in a higher level of commitment. Maybe had children, a wife, whatever, husband, wife, whatever. Um, was going around acting single. They're attractive. They're funny. They're fun. They're spontaneous. They're, they're fun to hang out with, fun to go out and drink with. Uh, but they kept a little secret from you. And I feel like it was either you didn't know that they were in a higher level of commitment or a marriage, or they kept saying, I'm going to leave, I'm going to leave, I'm going to leave. Now, blocking it is that commitment. They couldn't give you what you wanted. They couldn't give you emotion. Um, it could have left you feeling ignored, bored, right? Rejected. Yep, the sun is being blocked, happiness and the world. Because this person has a cycle open and they were being sneaky. There's lies, deception, sneaky, lying, cheating, sneaking, stealing. We have the sun, Leo energy, the world. This cycle was not closed out for this person. And I feel like they lied to you about quite a few things or fooled you or manipulated you, gaslighted you into thinking like I'm in separation or we're broken up. We just live together. So, some kind of stupid whatever. I feel like this person was trying to do that. Yeah, they could have had kids. Uh, you could have met this person at work. Could have met him at work. All right, let's see. What are their intentions towards you, Scorpio? The wheel in reverse. You guys also, for some of you, could like travel for work or something, or you live at a distance. That could have been a blockage here. All right, what are their intentions towards you, Scorpio? What is this person's intentions? Nine of Pentacles. Okay, it, it, let me keep going. Because it could mean they want to get single to come towards you. Or they just, they just want to be single. Um, they want to make a decision. What is this decision for Scorpio? King of Wands. They want to upgrade, level up. I have King and Queen of Wands here. Now I have the Emperor. Aries energy, Leo energy. This person, uh, they like to be in control. They like to have control, take control, authoritative figure. Again, you might work with them. They could be your boss or you them. Uh, I just, I feel like there's a lot of ego here with this person. Yeah, listen, Scorpio, this person's gonna like make a little offer to you and then just turn around and ignore you. Their intentions are not good. I feel like they just want to get you into bed. Yeah, they want to heal and mend this, probably because maybe you said enough is enough. This person, I feel, is a player. <sighs> How do they truly feel about you, Scorpio? The world. That keeps coming out for you guys. They think the world of you, Scorpio. You're so kind and loving and caring and giving. Let me take advantage of it. That's how I feel with this person's energy. I don't like it. Let's see. How do they feel? What are their feelings towards Scorpio? Emotions. I'm not taking all of these. There's way too many. Planting seeds or thinking the grass is greener. How do they feel about Scorpio? How do they feel? How does this person feel about Scorpio? Abandoned. Drama, fighting, arguments, disputes, too many people involved. Does this person, because Scorpio, you are super intuitive. Yeah, Justice and Page of Swords, Libra energy. 
they feel like either you're watching them online or they're watching you or both, all right? Um, there could be little arguments, text messages, things like that. They know that you want things to be fair and balanced here um, or justified, uh, their behavior, but they feel like you, uh, it's almost like you abandoned them because they wouldn't give you their all. So you called it quits and now they feel abandoned, but really you're the abandoned one. They, they like to twist, project, gaslight. Yep, you're, you're blocking off. You're, they feel like you blocked your energy off from them. Yeah, Knight of Swords, Gemini energy. This person really wishy-washy. I feel like they're going to like come and chase you, but they're going to rush in and rush out. Rush in and rush out. They're going to probably come towards you like, I want to do this. I love you. You mean everything to me, Scorpio. And then it's like, then they ghost. They disappear. They're out. You, you are keeping yourself protected and guarded from this person. Because I feel like you see the truth now. Like that mask came off and you you see now what this person's all about. And it's all games. Ooh. Let's see. Potential outcome. Keep in mind you have free will. So do they. So it can change, but let's see. What are you going to do, Scorpio? What are you going to do? Um, I'm not here to tell you what to do either. All right, the emperor wants to talk. <laughs> this person, and emperor, male, male or female, doesn't matter, no gender. They showed up as emperor, okay? That's why I said maybe they're your boss or... Um, the Emperor can have a little bit of controlling energy, dominant energy, mm -hmm. toxic controlling now, the devil, Capricorn energy. This person doesn't want you to leave them, but they can't give you what you want. Oh, I know this energy all too well. The magician, yeah, that's that's positive manifestation. When it's next to the devil, it's games, it's manipulation, it's trickery. This person's a trickster. And they're they're gonna try and communicate with you to make you believe all these false false hopes and keep you waiting. They they want you to be right there waiting for them when they're ready, when it's convenient for them. They want you right there just waiting for them. Like booty call. I'm sorry, this reading's a little tough, you guys. I'm just trying to be honest here at the tower. There's your energy, Scorp. What is this tower? What is this tower? The moon, the unknown. the two of cups you could have been kind of like lurking watching following and not in a stalker way in your research scorpionic investigative gotta get my answers gotta get to the bottom of it kind of way and that could have created the tower moment that could have been when you found something out what is this two of cups person could have been married or with with a Capricorn judgment or reconciled with somebody I don't I don't think it's you I think they were playing that card I'm getting divorced or I'm separated and I think you found out that that wasn't true you are making the judgment call here to stay single. Yeah, because you're not going to be left out in the cold like that. You're not going to be abandoned like that. You chose. You chose to, to leave this person alone, put in work and effort on yourself. 
they're 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 done you're done and you should don't, you don't need this you, you deserve better than this you're a treasure you have value you have worth you don't need this let's see biggest obstacles yeah the outsider this person won't let you in this shit's locked locked always leaving you out locking you out leaving you out in the cold not letting you in emotionally what else obstacles here for scorpio aloneness yep you're locked out and you're alone but that's okay that's okay because look letting go is going to lead to success letting this go is going to lead to success suppression don't don't bury this um and don't blame yourself that the people like this have a way of making you you feel like it's your fault don't do that. Breathe. Work through the hurt, the pain, the disappointment, the emotions. Work through it. Don't suppress it because you don't want to bring that into your next relationship or connection. That trust issues, that hurt, that pain. Um, but that could also be saying suppression from this person. They couldn't open up to you or you could never um, speak how you felt because it was always wrong, you know, something like that. All right, let's see. Let's see. Advice. Home. Cozy, warm, secure. Um, get comfortable at home, you know. Um, spend some time with yourself. Surrender, detach, trust, free fall, have faith, all will be well. Free will, choices, decisions, contact, and action. Action cannot be forced. Awakening, realization, progress. Your twin is awakening to this connection, but this could just be you awakening to this connection. Like, I see what this person's all about. Um, sacred space, altar, prayer, candles, commune with your own divinity, meditate, breathe, salt baths, walks in nature, spend time near water, you are a water sign, that is healing for you guys, um, all right, let's see, what would this person want to say to Scorpio, what would they want to say, what would this person like to say to Scorpio, to say finding out the truth crushed me can be vice versa all right so this could be you i remember every detail of that day you and i were too young so there could be an age difference here or something happened when you know you guys were just too young i'm grateful for the spiritual lesson i feel like this is more you let's see what these say back in response I forgive you. <sighs> Always your fault. I wondered how far this would go. I want to tell you so much. Uh, in that moment, I didn't care and you are not part of my plan. Ouch, this is harsh. This is a harsh reading, Scorpio. Um, all right, let's get some letters. Could be first, middle, last name, initials. Could spell a name, could spell a word of significance. I did pull a good amount. Maybe this resonates with a lot of you. Um, I go with my, my intuition here. I got K-B-X-E-F-O-U-M-P-W-V-R-I-N. K-B-X-E-F-O-U-M-P-W-V-R-I-N. Um, numbers could be birthday, anniversary, number of days, weeks, months, years. Could be angel numbers. Um, could be an age. Place it where you see fit. All right. We have one, one, 
So 11 or 1-1, one, one. you might be seeing a lot of 1s. And 5-6 and 2. So 1, 2, 5, 6, 12, 15, 16. Um, I did have 11. January, February, May, and June. Zodiac signs could be their sun sign, strong placements in their charts, or something could happen during that season, like Scorpio season. Right now. Um, all right, we got Scorpio, Cancer, Aries. Nope, sorry, Leo. Yep, and Aries. So Aries, Leo, Cancer, Scorpio. Could be anybody, you guys. Uh, a lot of other signs did pop out, so place it where you see fit. But Scorpio, that is what I have.